The UK government announced on Tuesday a new nuclear weapon policy to increase stockpile of warheads and to use them as a deterrent for cyber and artificial intelligence threats. Prime Minister Boris Johnson announces that the government will invest an extra £24 million in defence. The money will be used to modernise the UK's armed forces and to renew the nuclear deterrent. The new money will be focused on mastering the emerging technologies that are transforming warfare, reflecting the premium placed on speed and deployment and technical skill. In an integrated review published on Tuesday, it says the UK will not use or threaten to use nuclear weapons, but it states, however, we reserve the right to review this assurance if the future threat of weapons of mass destruction, such as chemical and biological capabilities, or emerging technologies that could have a comparable impact, makes it necessary. The UK will also increase the stockpile of nuclear warhead from 180 to a maximum of 260, a rise of 40%. A fleet of four Dreadnought-class nuclear submarines will replace the current Vanguard-class submarines in the 2030s, expected to cost £31 billion. In order to maintain the deterrent, the UK will not give public figures for the country's stockpile, deployed warhead or deployed missile numbers. The review also states, the UK's nuclear weapons are operationally independent and only the Prime Minister can authorise their use. We would consider using nuclear weapons only in extreme circumstances of self-defence, including the defence of our NATO allies.